epigenetics regulated phenomena there are three common epigenetics regulated phenomena they are cellular differentiation x chromosome inactivation and genomic imprinting cellular differentiation in cellular differentiation totipotent cells they are converted into the pluripotent cells so pluripotent cells they have the ability to differentiate into the lineages of the cells x chromosome inactivation which is usually seen in the females in case of x uh, x chromosome inactivation one of the x chromosome is down reg re regulated genes which are present on that x chromosome they down regulated that is due to the methyl cytosine methylation as well as modifications to the histones here we can see that how x chromosome inactivation in a female body there are bar bodies which are responsible x chromosome inactivation due to inactivation of the x chromosome we can see the mosaic cells in a female genomic imprinting genomic imprinting is a phenomena that is usually seen that in in case of genomic imprinting out of the two alleles one of the allele has the expression genomic imprinting is that uh, individuals they inherit two set of chromosomes sometimes gene on one chromosome they are active while sometimes genes on the other chromosome they are active so there are approximately 40 different genes that have been sh uh, shown uh, that are responsible for the genomic imprinting which are present on the different chromosomes epigenetics and a fragile x syndrome fragile x syndrome is usually a disease that is found in the humans this disease is due to a trinucleotide repeats in the normal individuals who do not have this disease they have 20 to 50 repeats of uh, trinucleotide c double g while on the other hand the individuals who are affected with this disease they have more than 200 repeats of uh, trinucleotide and it has been seen that more than 200 nucleotides and 200 uh, trinucleotide repeats are usually methylated identical twins is an other example of the epigenetics we see that identical twins they emerge from the same zygote during the during their development they experience same environment but over the time they have different environment and they experience different things that what is the difference between them when they become older they have different tags on their dna or on their genome which makes the difference between the twins due to which we see that one of the individual have the disease while the other individual do not experience the disease so these are due to the tags which are present on the chromosomes on the twins so we can conclude that common epigenetic phenomena are cellular differentiation x chromosome inactivation as well as genomic imprinting